Imam al Hassan alayhi salam was so generous that when he was dying, it is said that they came to the Imam and they noticed the Imam was crying. So a man said to him, O son of the Messenger of God, you gave away so much in your life that number one, Qasamta Allah Marratain. Twice in your life, or three times, excuse me, three times in your life, you divided your wealth in half and you gave away one half in the way of God and kept one half to yourself. And you did that three times, and twice in your life, you gave away everything you had in the way of God. You did that twice, and yet you're crying. What are you crying for? You're going straight to paradise. So the Imam said, Abki li firaq al ahabbati wa hawl al muttala. I cry, number one, for leaving my loved ones. A human being cries after all. You see your children, your family, you're leaving them all behind. And number two, wa hawl al muttala. Out of the sheer grandeur of what I'm about to face. Death has grandeur. Death has gravitas. Death is one of those things you don't joke about. And so even Imam al-Hasan says, the grandeur of death has overwhelmed me. Imam al-Hasan is the same person. Whenever they mentioned death to him, he would cry. Whenever they mentioned Resurrection for him, he would cry. Whenever they mentioned facing God on the day of judgment and reckoning, he would scream and then fall unconscious. Scream and then fall unconscious. How, you might ask? Isn't he infallible? What's he so afraid of? The answer is in Surah Fatir in the Holy Quran. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, see if you can memorize this verse. Innama yakhsha Allah min ibadihil ulama. Those who are learned, they fear God. 